Stuart Rimmer lining up in the number four shirt for Barnsley today. Of course, no stranger to the West Midlands, having recently moved for £150,000 from Warsaw. And he renews an acquaintanceship with the Barnsley number nine, Andy Savile, who also joined the Oakwell outfit from Warsaw. O'Connell outside, McCord on the overlap. It's a good cross in and a lovely flick and a superb goal. Andy Savile it is who puts Barnsley ahead after only five minutes. A superb cross by McCord. Savile neatly down to O'Connell. Outside him is McCord. Barnsley string the passes together very neatly. O'Connell on the overlap. Roberts with him. Neatly back to McCord and it's a good cross towards the back post surely. 2-0, well, from the same source, this time it's the other Andy Rammel that puts it into the back of the net, but it was another good cross from Brian McCord that created the chances, and Rammel totally unmarked on the back post. Chipped over the top for Rimmer to chase, Stahl unsure whether to come, 3-0. Yeah, well, would you believe it, it comes off the leg of Paul Stancliffe, just as the danger looked like it was going to be cleared, Paul Stancliffe, under no pressure, and the ball, let's be fair to him, bobbling up nastily in the area as the cross came in from Stuart Rimmer. He tried to put it into the net, I think, directly. It looked like it was going to be 3-0. Then it looked as if Stancliffe was going to clear it. Then it was 3-0. Marzi forward with Agnew. Archdeacon overlapping on the left, Agnew cuts inside, and that's a good shot, Stowell. Well, it's in the back of the net, 4-0. Well, Agnew's shot took a vicious bounce in front of Mike Stowell. He struck out an arm, seemed to have it covered, and the ball bouncing into the back of the net, and Barnsley, with their first attack of the second half, take the lead, 4-0. Onside, Rimmer was on the edge of his own half as that ball was played. Robinson just tees it up and fires it into the back of the net. Well, I think my expression was economy of effort in the Barnsley attack. And that really summed it up.